What is going on, guys? We are finally here with Undertale. I don't know anything about this game. I've heard nothing but really good things about it. So I was looking for a game to play through. Thought I would go through Undertale. No, like I said, I've never played it before. I know literally nothing about it. I'm trying to set up the controls now, as you can see. Some of you guys might have seen, I'm playing through Hollow Knight right now. The last chunk of footage I tried to record, it got really choppy and like all of it was pretty just like corrupted. And so I'm gonna take a break for Hollow Knight. I don't think my PC can handle it. So we're gonna go through Undertale. And so, I'm really excited. If you want to see more of this content, let me know in the comments so I know to keep making it. I'm pretty excited. I don't think it's that long of a game. And so, we'll, uh, now let's dive into it. Alright, so I gotta come up with a name here. Um, let's do Gotta stay true to the name. Oh, no, I did not do that right. Wait. Hold on. Alright, looks like we're going Basil. Basil. I like it. Alright, I think we're good. I'm excited for this. I've heard nothing but really good things about it. Oh, oh. Okay. There was a little video at the beginning that I gotta be honest, I was kind of trying to figure out how to get it full screen, so I didn't catch a lot of it, but it mentioned something about how uh, a long time ago there was like a war between humans and monsters, um, and then the humans won eventually, um, and they sealed the monsters away, and then something about a mountain, but I gotta be honest, I missed like all of it, so I don't know that much about it, so I don't, I have no idea who we are or what's going on right now. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Flowey? Flowey? Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't you? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Are you ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course! Cute. You want some love, don't you? I want all the love you have. Don't worry, I'll share some with you. This is adorable. Down here, love is shared through... Little white friendliness pellets. That's, a, that's suspicious. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. You idiot. Okay. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Shoot. That was uh, quite the 180. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Die. All right, so we do not want to touch these. What is, oh. What a terrible creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Can I see what this is? The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Oh, okay. So I can save. Dope. Okay. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Do I need to remember that? The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. How suspicious. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. 
To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Oh. BAM! Splendid! I am proud of you. <laughs> you proud of me? Let us move to the next room. If I flip this one. This switch doesn't even work. What? As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. You encountered the dummy. <laughs> So I, so I don't always have to fight. I can just act. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Wait, I just want to talk, right? You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won. You earned zero XP and zero gold. Well, that was worth it. Worthless. Very good. You are very good. Can I do? Can I try it again? Because there's other stuff too, so it looks like I can fight, or I can talk. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Ooh, I... This is easy money for sure. Frog it attacks you. We're not going to fight, we're going to act. Compliment. Frog it didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Nice. Why is everyone so afraid of Toriel? I hope I'm saying her name right. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Okay, okay. Oh, easy money. Okay, so we just need to see the path in this room. And that's going to help us know where to go. Can I, can I go? This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. I thought this was the puzzle you wanted me to solve. So kind. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. Alright, alright. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh, I don't like that. Okay. Oh, what is this? Greetings, my child. Do not worry. I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence, because she's not always going to be there. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. <laughs> okay. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? I feel like I'm supposed to keep going. There's no way. We're gonna keep going. Come here, frog. Ribbit, ribbit. <gasps> Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy. Okay. Oh, I can go up here. What's this? It says take one. Take a piece of candy. Sure. Press C to open the menu. Heals 10 HP. Has a distinct non-licorice flavor. Fascinating. Can I take another one? Nah, we've already taken. We've already taken one. Um. 
Okay, okay, interesting. Whimsome approached meekly. No, I don't want to fight. No, 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 no. I think that's... Okay. What does check mean? This monster is too sensitive to fight. <laughs> sniff, sniff. Oh, I gotta dodge the white. Okay. Whimsome is fluttering. Can I just... Okay. Interesting. Oh, dope. Alright, so we're at the other side. Ring. Hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? I'm more of a butterscotch kind of guy. If we're talking like candy, cinnamon's a little too spicy. So I'm gonna go butterscotch. Be scotch! Thank you very much. Click. You do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. I'm guessing she still thinks I'm at the room. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. How do I push it? Frog it hopped close. We just gotta compliment this guy, right? Frog didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Blushes deeply, ribbit. What? Froggit seems reluctant to fight you. Bam! Two gold! Let's go! We are rolling in the money. So now can I just... Nice! Uh-huh. I feel like I'm gonna fall. <gasps> Okay. Oh, this is probably the way I'm supposed to go. Okay, so it was over a little bit. Then I think it was up. Then over. Can I read this? Didn't you read the sign downstairs? Uh oh, I stepped on the leaf. And then it was just down. Then over and up, right? Bam! Okay, okay, okay. So three out of four rocks recommend you push them. Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? Now the rocks talk, so you're asking me to move over. Okay, just for you, pumpkin. You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Oh no, okay, that's okay, that's okay. I can probably move the other ones. Easy peasy. Uh-huh, but I need this one to go. That was the wrong direction. What a nice rock, thank you. Can I, can I thank him? Is he gonna move? I knew it! You're giving me a real workout. I don't trust this rock. Oh, come on. I think we can just... Alright, I'm guessing for a good amount of these I can just, uh... I can just spare them and probably be good. This is suspicious. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Save. Okay, so I'm guessing those are just save spots. Can I take this? This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Um. It's just sleeping. Are they gone yet? <laughs> This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to be asleep. Move it with force? No way! I guess I have to? Here comes Napsta Bluck. <laughs> I don't know if that's how you say that. Act. Flirt. Threat. Cheer. You gave Napsta Bluck a patient smile. <laughs> alright, alright. Easy, easy. Oh my goodness! Napsta Bluck looks just a little bit better. I'm fine, thanks. Really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. Uh, looks just a little bit better. Okay, 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 so don't do that. Check, threat, flirt. Flirt, I guess? I'd just weigh you down, aw. Wait, 
Wait, what did it say? Just a little bit better. I, we gotta cheer this guy up. He's very, uh, seems very self-conscious. You told him a little joke. <laughs> okay. What do these do? Oh, easy. Cheering seems to have improved his mood again. Or should I try to spare him? Or should I cheer again? Let's cheer one more time. He wants to show you something. Uh, I call it Dapper Bluke. Do you like it? Is he making a hat with his tears? Eagerly awaits a response. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around, but today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Okay. I feel like we can be nice to, or that we can like, be nice and nice our way out of any situation. So I'm definitely always gonna try to do that. Okay, there's a frog over there. What's over here? Some cobwebs. 7G, wait, what? Leave 7G in the web? How much do I have? Oh, it's our gold, obviously. Some spiders crawled down and gave you a donut. How nice. 18G, I don't have that much. You didn't have enough gold. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Okay. I have heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. Ah, oh, that is super good to know. What do you think of that? Wait, why are they so out of... It's very helpful. It is rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day you'll have to do it, even if their name isn't yellow. Oh. That's some that's some good foreshadowing right there. Interesting. Okay. Ring. Hello. I just realized that it has been a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying around lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Click. Okay, we've got some suspicious leaves. What up, dude? Just between you and me, I saw Toriel come out of here just a while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Yeah, I wonder if she's, uh, I wonder if she's got a secret or something. Is that a knife? You found the toy knife. Dope. Is that it? Just the knife? Alright. Alright, yep. So now we go up here. Uh, oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. Is she trying to call me? How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There, there, I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. What? Hide what? What are you hiding? No, I gotta see what- I gotta see. There's more. There's more. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie! Oh my goodness. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So we'll hold off on ugh, snail pie. Here, I have another surprise for you. Okay. Do I have to go that way? Yeah, let's do it. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Is she patting my head? Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Okay, so this is mine. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. Then they aren't cool! An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kids' shoes in a disparity. Ugh. Yeah, I don't, I don't trust, uh, I don't trust this chick. Was I supposed to do that? Butterscotch cinnamon pie! You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie! What does it do? 
Butterscotch pie. All HP. One slice. Alright, can I explore a little bit? What is this? It's Toriel's diary. Read the circled passage? Of course, you read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. It's her. The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This is our new home, which we named home. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy in names. <laughs> LOL. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Did you want something? What is it? When can... When can... <laughs> Nothing. Talk to me again if you need anything. What happens if I, yeah, what happens if I ask her? I have to do something. Stay here. Is she gonna come back? I don't think she's coming back. Let's go find her. Something suspicious. A little, uh, little sus. I don't like that the music just cut out. Oh, this is... You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it! No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. I can't let you do that. I need to get out! Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I'm only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. I can't, I can't go to my room, Toriel. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have to. Whew. Something's about to go down. You want to leave so badly? <laughs> you are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Toriel blocks the way. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Oh baby, oh baby. All right, all right, all right. All right, that wasn't too bad. She prepares a magical attack. Uh. We're just gonna keep trying, ah! Toriel is acting aloof. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Oof. She looks through you. Ironic. Okay, it's the same thing. I don't really know what to do. Ah! She looks through you. Uh, I should probably use an item here. We're gonna die. Pie, I guess. Uh. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of damage. Okay. I don't want to fight her. What if I flee? Am I supposed to die here? Because she's going to kill me. Don't slow me down. That is right. Go upstairs. Already? What will it take for you to learn your lesson? Oh crap, what is this? Please, wake up. You are the future of humans and monsters. So clearly, this person 
Whoever, I don't even know who just talked to us. It could have been, maybe it was that super bad person that she was talking about. Maybe they're haunting our dreams. I don't want to fight her. I have to? Uh, I guess. Okay, so we did a little bit of damage there. Oh, I'm just so dead. There's just no way we'd- Oh! Oh my gosh. Oh, we're so gonna die. What's the- Ah! Uh... What? I'm so gonna die. Okay. If I just stay here while I die? Is she purposefully missing right now? What is happening? Ah! What is going on? I don't want to hurt her. Ooh, that was bad. I feel like she's just purposefully missing us right now. Oh, I don't like this at all. I don't want to kill her. You are stronger than I thought. Listen to me, small one. If you go beyond this door, Keep walking as far as you can. Eventually you will reach an exit. Asgore, do not let Asgore take your soul. His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. Oh man, this is, I really hope she doesn't die. Because what's she? Is that her heart? Did I just kill her? <laughs> Bro! You serious right now? Well, don't I feel like a, just a tool? I don't want to play the rest of this game, man. This sucks. Oh no. It's flowy. Hee hee hee. I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That old hag thought she could break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans, but when it came down to it, she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. Let's do it. In we go. Undertale. Cool. What an intro, man. I really, I really hope she had to die. Otherwise, I'm going to feel really bad. Okay. I want to find somewhere to save after all that. Ugh, who is that? And I cannot move. Human, don't you know how to how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. The old whoopee- oh. <laughs> Oh man, that scared me. The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans? 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 Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. 
quick behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Sup, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp? It's all really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. That's the dream. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> Sans, you dog. That's funny. Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it. <laughs> Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. Hug! I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Aha! Uh -huh. Loving the puns. Alright, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Actually, hey, I hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you just might make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. He's gonna take me. Alright, good save point. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah, guys, I think that's uh, going to do it for this first episode. I really like the game so far. I was a lot more uh, conflicted over killing Toriel than I, I thought I would be for a game. It's uh, definitely just like knowing that I can spare people and also kill them makes it a lot more like consequential when I decide to kill someone. And so I hope that that was the only option I had. But I'm really enjoying the game. I really like it a lot. Like I said, if you want to see more of these videos or if you have other games for me to play through, let me know down in the comments. Um, other than that, I think that's all I got. I hope you guys know that Jesus loves you, and so do I. We'll see you in the next one.